Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a pack with me video. This is the bag I will be traveling with to Disney World for five days. This is the bag I plan on taking with me as my carry-on item on the plane to Florida. And I feel like this is definitely my go-to travel bag, my Louis Vuitton Neverfull. This is in the GM size and it's a big bag. It carries all the things. I need my uh, travel essentials with me on a trip like that. I feel like although we're going to Disney World this time, these travel essentials are the travel essentials I would take with me on any trip. So if that sounds interesting, then just keep watching. So I grabbed this from my closet this morning, planning on getting this all packed up with you guys. So don't forget to like this video if you enjoy it. And I'd love it if you'd subscribe so that you can also see me pack my suitcase for myself and my two children. My husband will be on his own for packing. <laughs> it works out better that way. So I'm gonna go ahead and just share that I have already put in this really great sort of organizer. Kind of gives the bag a little bit of structure. It also adds a little bit of room with pockets and helps to keep things organized as I travel. This is the Ami style um, organizer. I've had this for years pretty much as long as I've had this bag and it's held up really nicely. So I do recommend that one. So in it goes, and then I do still have some more room on the sides as well as this handy dandy pouch or zipper pocket on the sides. So all of these things will be much needed for this trip. So I'm gonna go ahead and begin with this really great sort of book pouch I picked up from Amazon. This is such a well thought out pouch. I love this. You just reach in your bag and grab out your book with all the things. So let me show you. This is the book I'm taking with me. I have not started it yet. I can't wait. I have recently read The Nightingale by this author, Kristen Hanna. It was so good I couldn't put it down. I read that book so fast and I don't read as much as I would like, but that book was such a good, easy read. So I'm looking forward to another book by her. So I picked this up um, from Amazon and can't wait to start that book on the plane. Also, I'm gonna put in here my Lily Palutzer notepad. I'm always taking notes, I'm always writing things down and it's just a good place to keep it with my book. And then I really love to carry highlighters with me. These are beautiful pastel color highlighters. And then I have to have my color pens and I love that everything is just kept together. So I wanna pull my notebook out and write down some ideas or some notes. Um, my pens are right there with it. And then another thing I'll always do is I will add this fantastic little book light to my bag and it's really nice because all you do is clip it onto your book that you're reading and turn on your light and it has all different um, light brightness as well as different lighting like the colors so it's like a softer light or a more intense light it's a really good one got it off amazon it is such a good book light and i just kind of keep that in the bag so everything is together and then one final thing that I always keep with me in my cute little book pouch are just a few extra bookmarks. These are the magnetic kind. They're super nice, super convenient, and sometimes I will lose them and I need some extra bookmarks. And so it's really nice and convenient to just tuck those in there. Everything is right here in my book pouch my book I can't wait to start reading, my notebook, my highlighters, my pens, my book lights, and my bookmarks. So really genius, I love this. So that's gonna go in. I'm actually gonna put it in this far back space, just like that, and grab my iPad, because I definitely will need this while I'm gone. And I'm just gonna put it in this really cute sort of cushiony it's a really soft thick lining inside so it just protects your iPad while you travel and again easy access you know exactly 
where it is right here in your pouch. I'm gonna put that on this side of the bag. These great little plastic pouches, they're see-through so you can see what you have. I love that they're all different colors and you can just buy a pack of these on Amazon. And it's really great how you can just fill these up. So this first little pouch, I'm gonna go ahead and put some of these lens wipes in here. I need these for not only my regular glasses, but also my sunglasses. And they're just really great lens wipes. So I'm gonna put these in this front pouch just so I can find them when I need to. Easy access, love that it's clear. It just makes it so nice for finding things. And then I'm just gonna zip that up. There we go, all my lenses right there in that cute little pouch. Next, I'm going to put some mints in here. I'm also gonna add a bunch of my absolute favorite Orbitz gum right in there. I love having everything kind of organized in these cute little pouches. I'm also gonna add my Crest Scope breath freshener right in there. All my minty freshness right there in that little pouch. In this one, I'm gonna go ahead and add some of these wet ones. These are really nice for travel, especially with kids. Um, antibacterial hand rifes, they have a really nice fresh scent to them. I'm gonna put those in this little pouch. That's all set. And then I'm also going to use this pouch. My daughter gets motion sick very easily on the plane, even at Disney World on some of the roller coasters, so I have to be prepared. So I need Dramamine. Um, I'm also gonna take some Mucinex cloth drops for allergy season, because that's a real problem right now. And then I'm also going to add to this little pouch these little Dramamine Nausea Ginger Chews. I have never tried these. If you guys have, let me know if they actually work, but they're a more natural way um, of helping with motion sickness. So I thought we would give these a try this time. So I'm actually gonna open these up and put these in here as well. And to pour these in here. And then I'm also gonna add some of these they're Band-Aid brand, but these are basically, if you get blisters, they're those jelly thick pads. So if my kids or my husband and I get any sort of blister, those are such a lifesaver. And then I'm also gonna take some Tums, cause you never know when the spaghetti or the chili dog you eat seeks revenge on you, you're gonna want some of those. So now that I have my really cute little pouches with all of the things. I'm gonna go ahead and put them in this cute little pouch I have. And that's just gonna keep them super organized and together. And I'm gonna know for these little essentials exactly where to find all of them. And they fit in there so nicely. Isn't that cute? And then what I'm gonna also add to this are these toilet seat covers that I picked up off Amazon. Um, there's 10 in here, and I'm just gonna put that in there as well. So that little glam pouch has all those things, and it stays really organized and really cute. So there are those essentials. Those are gonna go in here. And then next, I'm gonna go ahead and with this really cute little pouch I picked off from Amazon. And in here, I'm just gonna put some of my snacks. My kids are old enough to bring their own backpack and they will be putting their snacks, their tablets and switch and all the fun things in there. But I'm going to take my zero sugar Twizzlers, aspartame free, these are the strawberry ones. I love Twizzlers, but I'm trying to be good as much as possible 
Now that's not to say I'm not gonna eat some goodies at Disney World, I am, but you know, I'm trying to be good until we get there at least. <laughs> I got some Jolly Ranchers Zero Sugar and I'm gonna put those in there. And then I'm also gonna take my Chewy Mix Trail Bar by Nutrisystem. And I'll probably add a few more snacks before we head out, but it is nice to have them all together in a pouch. So if I need a snack, I know exactly where I need to find them. So that's what we're looking at. So far, we still have loads and loads of room. And now you know why I grabbed the GM Neverfull for this trip. <laughs> okay. So next I'm going to grab my Louis Vuitton pouch. This is the pouch that came with the Neverfull. And in here, I'm going to put my electronics that I need to take with me. So I'm going to start with my little cord that I need for my portable charger. That's going to just go in the slip pocket. I'm also going to put my Apple watch charger right in there to take with me. And then in the main pouch compartment, I'm going to go ahead and put my phone charger, just the regular charger in here. And then I'm also going to go ahead and add my portable charger because I'm going to need this so much, especially on the park days. And then I'm also going to add my AirPods because I'm going to need that, especially on the plane. I'm sure I'll listen to some music or even watch a show on my iPad. And then I'm also going to take this really great um, electronics screen cleaner. So this is great for cleaning your kids switch, any of your kids tablets, my iPad, my iPhone. Um, it's really, really good. And I take it with me anytime I go on a trip because we use our tablets on the plane or in the car, depending what kind of trip it is. And then I just take this little microfiber cloth that comes with it and then just clean all the tablets periodically, just so one, they can see their tablet with all those smudge marks, but then they also keep it a little bit cleaner, a little bit more germ-free, which I definitely appreciate. So I'm going to go ahead and add this. And then I'm also going to go ahead and add my sunglasses to the bag. Can't go anywhere without sunglasses, especially sunny Florida. I have my really cute card holder by Kate Spade and my husband picked up a bunch of Disney World gift cards. It just kind of helps keep us on a budget. That way we know kind of what we're spending while we're at the parks. These are really good. You can get a pretty good discount by picking up the gift cards. It saves you some money. You're not gonna save money any other way. So <laughs> this is kind of how we do it. And it's free money to buy the gift cards and use these instead of your credit cards, so why not? So I'm gonna go ahead and put these in the pouch section of this bag. I'm also going to add my Louis Vuitton full-size Clemens wallet. I always take my wallet with me and this one's going to go in the pouch as well. And I'm just going to go ahead, set that up for just a little bit of extra security while I'm on, my, on the plane. I'm also going to take my Day planner, this is the little size. This is great for travel. I can't go anywhere without my planner. I feel like my life is in this tiny little book. <laughs> and without it, I have no idea what I'm doing that day, what my kids are doing that day, and I get in a lot of trouble if I don't have this. So I'm gonna put that in one of those really cute little pockets right there. So next, I'm going to add my makeup pouch. This is the most beautiful little pouch I picked up. This came with a perfume I got from YSL for my makeup. So I'll start with a face powder for touch-ups. Now I will say I do pack my toiletries and my makeup bag in my suitcase. So if you're interested in that video, definitely don't forget to hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any future videos that will be coming up. Um, I'm also going to add my contacts case. I'm also going to add a couple of lipsticks. These are two of my favorite. This one is a YSL lipstick. It's 
Rouge Shine in the number 41. And it is so pretty. These lipsticks are so creamy. I'll show you just how beautiful and creamy that is. I'm a huge fan of YSL. They have a nice sheen and shine to them. They have some nice color. It's like a wash of color. It's not too intense. I love that. And then this other one is by Dior. This is Dior Addict number 373. And this one has a little bit of sparkle, not too much. And it's a little bit more of a nudie pink. It's beautiful. I like a pop and a neutral. So I always carry usually two lipsticks, sometimes more. I love lipstick. All right, so next I have a bunch of liquids, which I'm gonna have to pull out of my makeup pouch once I go through security. So what I automatically do is I'll grab my liquids. This is my contact solution. I'm going to carry my um, Brit For Her perfume. I'm also gonna carry an extra hand sanitizer just because I'll need extra at Disney World when we get there. I have to have some eye drops because my allergies are horrendous this time of year. And then I also really like this Lumify eye drops. This is really great for really getting that red eye look out of your eyes. It really clears things up, gives you a bright eyed look. I'm also gonna take some Scope Crest. I have another one. Um, I think I put it in the goodie bag. I actually need to pull that out for my liquids. And then I also have this amazing L'Occitane hand cream. So, so good. Can't leave home without that one. I also have a tiny little Chanel, Coco Chanel sample. I try to use those up whenever possible because I don't like to throw them away. They smell divine. So I try to use them when I travel. And so I'm gonna go ahead, pop that in there. And this is going to be my little travel makeup pouch. Like I said, when I go through security, I just pull up my liquids and put it in the bin. And then I haven't put my um, glasses in here yet, but those would go on the plane with me, especially if I have irritation with my contacts, I can take them out and put my glasses on for the duration of the flight. Um, but they all fit in there seamlessly. And that's my little makeup pouch for the plane. It's looking good, full and good. All right, so I'm also gonna take a hair clip with me in case I'm gonna put my hair up. So, and then I also have my Touchlin Power Mist hand sanitizer. I am going to pull this out and put it in the bin as well with my other liquids when I go through security. I did attach this really cute little keychain I got off Amazon. It has the Eiffel Tower, a little coin, and three little macaroons, which is so cute. And then what I plan on doing for easy access to my hand sanitizer, so I don't have to dig around in the bag, I'm gonna put it right here in this little D-ring. And that way, anytime I need my hand sanitizer, throughout the trip, I just pull it up and we're good to go. So that's where that's gonna go. I'm just gonna tuck it in a little better so it's just not frailing around. But that is what everything looks like. And I am really looking forward to my trip. But I cannot wait um, to share my packing video. I'll be packing my toiletries, my makeup bag, and my suitcase. And I would love it if you guys would join me. So. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. And I'd love it so much if you'd subscribe to my channel so I can see you in my next videos. And until next time, bye guys.